One in five breast cancer patients develops lymphedema. It's a buildup of fluid in the arms after doctors remove lymph nodes during cancer surgery. WFMZ's Melanie Falcon has more in Health Beat. If not detected and treated early, lymphedema can become a lifelong struggle. But luckily, there's a new device that can give a woman and her doctor early warning. Over the past two years, Kathy Lahr has been through a challenging health journey with her husband, Bernie, by her side. Let's see, that's four, five, six, seven. Kathy was diagnosed with breast cancer in 2019. I never felt a lump. I had no discomfort. We, it was very small. Kathy had a double mastectomy and later chemo for ovarian cancer. She stayed positive and strong, but one diagnosis really got to her. I never cried from first diagnosis till the end of chemo I didn't cry but I came very close the day they told me I had lymphedema lymphedema is a painful buildup of fluid in limbs caused by damage to lymph nodes hi Kathy are you ready fortunately Kathy's doctor caught the condition very early on using a new device called the sozo I guess a good way to describe it would be like an EKG of your of your arms uh, which gives an indirect measurement of how much fluid is is in the in the extremity patients like Kathy is Take off their shoes and socks, step barefoot onto the device, and grab two handles. Now, patients can't feel it, but medical therapists will look for a change in what's called an LDEX score, which is a measurement of fluid under the skin. If the measurement goes up, patients start treatment early, wearing a compression sleeve like this one. Kathy did that for a month, and it worked. The early intervention meant no visible swelling. I caught a big break because it cleared it right up and I'm fine. Oh, that's a good one. Healthy again and enjoying her time with Bernie. <laughs> A Dr. Turner says research suggests that 97% of patients who wear the compression sleeves for a month before the condition is noticeable can completely avoid chronic lymphedema. For Health Beat, I'm Melanie Falcon.